Life in the Brahmaputra, Ganga Basin The subtropical Ganga Brahmaputra Basin is characterized by its mountains, plains and delta region. It lies in the straits of Uttarakhand, Uttar Pradesh, Bihar, West Bengal, Assam, etc. Climate It is very cool in the mountain regions to steep slopes and hence sparsely populated. The rest of the region usually has monsoon climate. The summers are very hot and winters cool. The monsoon lasts between mid-June and mid-September. Vegetation and Cultivation The mountains have coniferous trees like fir, pine and deodar. In gentle slopes and foothills of mountains, terrace farming is done. For this type of farming, the slope is flattened so that the water does not run away and on the flat surface, crops are grown. In the Ganga Brahmaputra plain, deciduous trees like teak, sal and people are grown. In the Brahmaputra plain, mangroves grow naturally. Thick bamboo groves too are common. Plains are very fertile and are used for agriculture by the people living there. Paddy is the main crop grown. It is grown in the areas having lot of water. Other crops include wheat, maize, sorghum, gram and millets. Banana plantations, cash crops like sugarcane and jute are grown in some parts of the plains. In West Bengal and Assam, tea cultivation is also done. Silk is produced through silkworm cultivation is done in parts of West Bengal and Assam. Life in the Brahmaputra Ganga Basin 2 Wildlife A variety of animals such as elephants, deers, tigers, monkeys, the one-haunt rhinoceros in the Brahmaputra plain can be found. Bengal tiger, crocodiles and alligators can be seen in the delta region. Lots of fish varieties such as Rohu, Katla and Hilsa can be found in the fresh water lakes, rivers and sea of Bay of Bengal. Susu or the blind dolphin varieties is abundant in the fresh waters of River Ganga and Brahmaputra. Its presence indicates the health of the rivers. However, now because pollutants such as chemicals from the industries in the rivers, the existence of this dolphin is threatened and is slowly diminishing. The Lake Ecosystem In the Oxbow Lakes, several fish varieties are cultivated. The local Valinaria and Hydrilla weed form the food for the fish. Around the lake, land is very fertile and hence used by the farmers to grow paddy, maize and pulses. Buffaloes are used to till this land. There is ample fish catch for the farmer to eat as well as sell in the local markets. So as long as the lake is not polluted, it remains rich and helpful to the communities for fish cultivation. People Population density, the number of persons living in one square kilometre area is varied across the basin. For example, density of Uttarakhand is 189, in West Bengal is 1029 and 1102 in Bihar. More than 10 lakh people stay in the major cities along the basin. The rivers are getting polluted because of the waste water and pollutants from the cities. Waterways, roadways and airports are well developed in the plains. Ports too are well developed especially in cities like Kolkata on River Hooghly. Tourism is an important activity for livelihood. There are several attractive tourist areas such as Taj Mahal on the River Yamuna, Elhabad Sangam or confluence of the rivers Ganga and Yamuna, wildlife sanctuaries Kaziranga and Manas in Assam, the Imam Bada in Lucknow, etc.